Welcome to this video tutorial about the Dollybar ERP and CRM system. In this video, we will look at how to use the Bills of Materials and Manufacturing Orders modules in Dollybar. Prerequisites Activate the module Bills of Materials and the module Manufacturing Orders from the menu Home, Setup, Modules. Grant permission on the Bills of Materials module and the Manufacturing Orders module for your users. For more advanced information on how to set up permissions for users, you can watch our video Users, Groups and Permissions. Creating a Bill of Materials A Bill of Material is the list of raw materials, components, parts and the quantities of goods needed to manufacture an end product. Let's create a new bill of material. Provide a label. Choose the actual end product that is to be created with this bill of material. Choose the quantity and provide a description. Provide the estimated time duration to manufacture the chosen product. Choose the warehouse for production and click the button to continue. Now you are ready to specify the raw materials belonging to this bill of material. Type the name and choose from the pre-populated list of materials. Provide the quantity as well as other attributes and click on the Add button. You can add multiple raw materials one by one. Use the Linked Files menu to add any file attachments to the Bill of Material. Once you're done, click on the Validate button. The Events tab captures the complete list of all past and upcoming events related to the Bill of Material, such as creation, update, etc. Use the Clone button to create a similar bill of material without having to re-enter all the information. Creating a manufacturing order Once the bill of material has been created, the next step in the manufacturing process is the creation of a manufacturing order. There are two ways to create a manufacturing order. You can do it from the new menu item under Manufacturing Orders you can also use the Create MO button available in the Bill of Materials to create a manufacturing order for that Bill of Material. The Bill of Materials specific parameters are pre-filled. Provide a label and the quantity to produce. All other fields are optional. Review the raw materials listed at the bottom, which will be consumed for this order. Click on the button to create the manufacturing order. Click the Validate button to approve the manufacturing order for production. Consuming and producing. Open a manufacturing order. The Production tab tracks consumption and production. Click on Consume or Produce. You can define quantity to produce and consume. Once validated, stock movements will be recorded. Clicking on Consume and Produce All has the same effect as Consume or Produce button, but all the remaining quantities to consume and produce are automatically filled. Status of the manufacturing order will be automatically modified if all quantities are consumed and produced. You can also modify it manually. Other features Use the Clone button to create a similar manufacturing order without having to re-enter all the information. 
The Stock Movements tab tracks the relevant stock movements done for consumption and production. Use the Linked Files menu to add any file attachments to the manufacturing order. The Events tab captures the complete list of all past and upcoming events related to the manufacturing order, such as creation, update, etc. There are also plenty of other features that can be enabled from the module setup, such as templates and watermarks. Also, like most other Dolly Bar modules, you can add your own custom fields to describe your bills of materials and manufacturing orders and define default values or mandatory fields. You can use the import or export modules to import or export your bill of materials and manufacturing orders database. Thank you for watching this video tutorial. Visit www.dollybar.org to learn more.